hi guys welcome back to my channel i just quickly want to um drop five things five things i've learned from covid19 yes all right let's kick off okay. one thing that i've learned from covid19 is learn to appreciate god yes for those of us that are christians and if you're not a christian i'll urge you to be a christian because there's nothing like having christ the owner of your life having him knowing him is everything this is just the beginning of end time okay it's the beginning of the birth pain of the end time and the Bible says in all things give thanks to God because the Bible also relates it to the fact that um, he will make everything, I don't know in my words now, like he will make everything work for the good of they that love God and work according to his purpose. Yeah, and I'm glad to be called by God and work ac working according to his purpose makes me have that joy that, you know, having that scripture to back me or just make me want to thank God the more because the more I thank him, the more he, he remembers what he has to do and he does it for me. <laughs> You know, my two things I've learned um, during this COVID-19 period is um, quiet time. Yes, quiet time. Having a quiet time with God because this lockdown period, many people have, many people have been um, tired. They've been ooh, like, oh, I'm tired of everything. Um, you know, they are... They are looking at the bad side of it, you know, they don't use the time wisely, they don't spend the time wisely, they are just looking at, oh, yes, I won't lie, yes, I was, it got to a time I was almost hallucinating, I was seeing things were falling off, I would be shouting, you know, just like, oh, God, when is all this, but it got to a time, the Spirit helped me to really see the good side of this COVID-19, that um, I really needed a fellowship with God, the more, because I don't want to settle, it's not good for you to settle for where you are, in Christianity, there's no comfort, like, there's no comfort, I really had a lovely time with my God, in spirit, and I can tell you what I've learned in this period, because I was locked down too much, because after the, in the third month, I started to work, so, I, what I've learned in those two months of time, I haven't and I wouldn't have learned such in my lifetime for years. The number three thing I've learned during this COVID-19 is to check up on people. Yes, check up on people. I remember, I'm not really good at check up, yes. That is true. I won't lie to you. I'm not good at checking up. I do check up, but not as the people will want me to. Yeah, you know, I'm not regular, I'm not consistent in it. I just feel you're fine and I pray for you and I just think everything's okay afterwards. I just have faith that you're good. You know, out of 10 times I check up on you like twice. Yeah, it's not, it's very poor, I know. And I'm trying to work on it and it really helps me a lot. You know, I, I really appreciate it. A lot of people that checked up on me made me see how and why it is necessary and it's helpful to check up on people. And I must tell you the truth, I'm still working on it, but I thank God for the knowledge that came, that came to me this period of time. And, you know, they checked up on me, those times to give me, it's where I do that encouraging faith and, um, you know, you just have a way of boosting your, your, your spirit to be alive. Number four. Um, this life there is nothing and it's just you and God you don't have anything and anybody because you you have them because they love you you do things together but at the long run at the end of everything it's just you and God because when you die people that have died they are going to meet God at last because they are going to stand before their maker and then narrate everything that went on and on and on and on so it's just you and God you just don't know you like I don't have anything so if it's just me and God and God is more than I am he's superior he created me he taught me to do this do this. why don't I just obey and let him have his focus because I don't know what tomorrow holds it may be mm, I may not die of COVID but I may just sleep I will not just wake up my rapture has come like that I just you know I want to I'll go to rest until the trumpet sound and I'll resurrect me the number five thing that COVID-19 taught me was, or is, um, learn to give. Learn to give. This period, I learned, I already, I am naturally a giver by the grace of God. I give, even up to my, this is my jacket. If you told me I like a jacket and I want to, I'll give you, you know. 
I give everything to the extent that sometimes I am left with nothing. But um, it really doesn't bother me except people that are disturbing my ear. You don't have anything. I told you that. No, you know, it's okay. Let's just, <laughs> let's just take it like that. So, but this time around, it dawned on me like the reason behind giving and why it is really necessary because a lot of people were were out of shelter, they ran out of food, they ran out of clothing, they ran out of, you know, basic amenities of life and they were really stranded and you are there, you have two euros, you can actually divide that two euros into five or six or ten and share, you know, I had money to do something and um i have been planning to do this stuff for like quite some time and i wasn't doing it because i don't know why because of the, i don't know what reason i was being delayed but it got to this time and i knew that it was because of the covid 19 god was saving me the stress of you know spending that money then so i decided to share the money and I really didn't bother about the thank yous, but I um the hearts that the thank yous were coming from. It dawned on me that God is good because He gave, we should give, even our time. It relates also to the checkup that I was telling you how to check up on people, how to do this, you know. It's really, it's really, it's really a lot. Yes. And also, let me do this bonus. The bonus will make it six. Alright, the bonus is that. COVID-19 helped me to find out different recipes. <laughs> Bye.